Bye guys. Money speaks only one language. If you save me today, I will certainly, for sure, will save you tomorrow. Hi guys, my name is Karan, and in today's video, in your channel, we will be discussing five do's of financial planning. Five must do's before we do financial planning. Okay, so let us get on to these five do's. Before the first do, we have already discussed what financial planning is. It is planning for your financial health. Step number one, as a must do, is having an emergency fund. Guys, we all live in world of uncertainty. Okay, job losses. We have seen people get fired for no rhyme or reasons. If company um, suffers a loss. first thing they do is to fire people right so what i want to say is that have a emergency fund at least 6 months of your salary 6 months of the expenditure you should have in your emergency fund that will give you cushion when you are doing your financial planning okay step number 2 having sufficient amount of medical and life insurance with that i mean to say you might be having your corporate um, medical insurance we call them group but if job is uncertain your health insurance is also uncertain because you step out of your house you are exposed to lot of risks and medical expenditure these days run into lakhs and it would be a nightmare for you to spend them from your own savings it would be very difficult make arrangements for your own health insurance policies these days in india you can very easily compare and buy life insurances maybe online these days right so having a personal life insurance for you yourself your parents all together is imperative for financial uh, planning and it's a must must do health insurance is covered now term uh, term life insurance i always advocate uh, insurance as a pure risk tool not a investment tool so buy a good term insurance for yourself maybe uh, 10 times your annual annual income if you have a uh, 30 lakhs go, go for like a uh, uh, crores of insurance term insurance you will get i think these days uh, the advertisements which are uh, publicized they talk about giving you a crore insurance in 500 600 rupees a month maybe so evaluate that go for a good term insurance of a high amount which will give you cushion and your family in case of a uncertain event in your family so that they are able to uh, meet their lifestyle your loans are taken care of guys because it's a personal experience uh, okay if you have a, a very high home loan and suddenly has a, something happens to you so you know these insurance policies might be handy go for a term insurance okay third must do for a good financial planning is to have a child education fund guys i never recommend anyone to use your retirement funds to pay for your child education do you want to depend on your children when you grow old if you spend your entire retirement corpus on them and then you become dependent on them to take care of you when you are old I think it is not right. It is not right in today's world where families are becoming nuclear. So I'm not saying that don't stay with your children, but I'm sh- what I'm saying don't be dependent on them financially. Arrangements can be made for their education. I have seen it in my family. Fantastic educational loans are available, which you can uh, take for your uh, children. and once they start their uh, jobs they will get tax advantage on the education loan use that okay do not touch your retirement corpus if possible have a separate fund for them maybe start one sip um, early during your your working years so that you are able to sponsor their education or marriage or anything of that sort with that i go to step number 3 uh step number 4 sorry for which is called your retirement fund as the word suggest 
रिटायरमेंट फंड फंड प्लानिंग शुड बी डन वंस यू स्टार्ट योर जर्नी ऑफ अर्निंग मनी व्हेन एज सुन एज पॉसिबल एज सुन एज पॉसिबल आई वुड से फ्रॉम द फर्स्ट पे चेक स्टार्ट एस आई पी डोंट वेट फॉर योर सेल्फ टू टर्न टू फिफ्टी एंड वेन यू नो देन यू स्टार्ट योर प्लानिंग द सून यू स्टार्ट द मोर कंपाउंडिंग बेनिफिट यू गेट and again remember retirement is not age driven it is income driven okay if your retirement fund is able to give you let's say 1.5 lakhs every month of interest income and i think and if you think it is enough for you you can retire at 40 also 45 also so retirement is not age driven it is income driven so start your retirement fund planning starting of the career don't wait for 40s or 50s fair point with last uh, with that i move on to my last point and i think it is very important for me and for everyone to just uh, make a note of this one because it is ignored it is ignored because we think it is not important point number 5 in financial planning guys is called make a will w i l l what is will basically it is a it is a document it is a it is your wish document on how your assets your investment will be distributed once you are gone okay do not assume that things will be smooth once you are gone sometime it becomes very uh, nasty do not assume that all your assets will automatically be passed through the through the law of succession in the country to your uh, spouse no it doesn't happen that way it might get a, a lot of complications your uh, children your uh, relatives might put a claim on your assets and don't think that these will and all these things are for business people no your shares your bonds your gold your property your flats your provident fund gratuity pension funds stocks mutual funds are all your assets guys make a will today talk to an expert get a will prepared as of 2022 23 sign it have a couple of um, witnesses get it notarized and just keep it somewhere and will can be changed do not worry it can always be changed if you if you feel that okay i want to make some changes revise your will only the latest will will be considered once you are gone okay with these i will i have covered five must do's for financial planning guys review the video again check where you need to make adjustments in your planning if something is missing do that build that into your portfolio and i wish all the luck in your financial planning journey i am there with you uh i understand all your problems because i have gone through the same journey i walked the same path let us continue to talk more let us continue to be friends i will see you in my next journey till that time i leave you with your wonderful thoughts guys may god bless you take care of yourself thumbs up for you victory for you